People say that I'm a UDA leader, but that's in my past. My past is firmly in my past. Charter ANI is my future. This is my future. I would agree with people. I am a leader. I'm a leader for education. I'm a leader for jobs. I'm a leader for working class communities. I'm a leader for the youth out there. That's where I lead. It's making a big difference. That is the reality for our communities. When people like me coming from a past that I came from, work in this environment and promote this environment as a good way to go for our communities, that's the way forward. Forward all the way, never look back. 20 years ago, I, we were in a bad place. And through the, our education and our focus within Charter, it's progressed me as a person and made me the person I am today. Power is a good thing, as long as it's used in a good way. I was using power in a negative way in the past, but I'm using a good power, a positive power in the future. This is who I am now, a man of peace. Wars in the past, and I promote peace. I'm part of the peace process. I promote the peace process. I'm fully engaged in the peace process. Peace is the way forward. Who would want to go back to that, what we had in the past? That's no good for our children. We have to give our children a future, a future where they can live and prosper. There is no role as a military organisation for the UDA anymore. The gun has been taken out of politics within loyalism for seven years now. The UDA, the military organisation, is in the past, firmly in the past. But we need that, that structure needs help to go through a transformational process. It needs help to go away. And the governments need help, need to help that organisation go through a transitional process to go away. We are planning within Charter because of our unique role and our relationship with that organisation. We're a conflict transformation organisation. Yeah. That's what we do. You can't help an organisation go through a transitional process without links to that organisation. That's what we do. We read it in our strategic plans. We read it in our annual reports. It's no secret our relationship with that organisation. I have been accused of being a drug dealer. And you know, I, I, just, I say, how can that be? I have a relationship with the police in all our local areas that we work. And that relationship is a planning relationship with community safety projects. And I give me, as part of that process, I give confidence to the local communities to pass information on about drug dealers in the local areas to the police. As a working example of that, a local community representative engaged with a, a member of the community. They gave us a ring. I facilitated the handover of £20,000 worth of methadone to the local banger police. That's a working example of what we do. Drugs is wrong, and I'm firmly against drug dealing within our areas.